Glutamine, first of all, is an amino acid, so there's no magic or craziness behind it. It is an awesome post-workout uh, powder that most people put in their shakes or what have you, or take it by pill. Post-workout because it's going to aid in the recovery of the muscle tissue you just damaged or you broke, broke down and you want to help rebuild it. Uh, it's also tremendous beforehand, and I think a lot of people miss, miss the boat on that part because A, it can be converted to glucose, so if the body needs energy, it's going to go to what's in the blood before it goes to break itself down. You don't want it to break down the, your muscle tissue to get energy. So it's going to go to, it's going to, go to that first. It's going to get the, the glucose from the glutamine, and that's going to be great. Also will help, may help prevent cortisol release because during high uh, energy levels, you know, high, when, you, when you work out a lot, you know, your blood sugar levels will drop and that, that drop in blood sugar will help, will release cortisol. And that being said, cortisol is catabolic or breaks down muscle tissue, pretty much counterproductive to everybody's goal, whether you're an athlete or whether you're my mom. Uh, you really want to increase your lean body mass, your muscle, because the more muscle you have, the more fat you burn. So that's the way people really want to change their bodies. Weight loss is really not the key, but the point is, if you can prevent that cortisol from being released, it's going to be tremendous. So you could take the glutamine before, and you can also then take it after. And the after is going to be tremendous just to help recover and repair what you just damaged when you worked out.